very good evening one and all today the session which i am going to conduct with you guys is going to devote two fraternities one is the parents and one is the students so i am going to talk about 10 important aspects in your life which will change your life forever the parents those are willing to make their what more successful in their lives or they want them to be developed in a way where you can feel proud on your child you need to ask him or her to do those 10 steps in entire life i know the commitment for the entire life is you big but as a parent it is your moral responsibility to look after your ward so let us talk about those important points in anybody's life which can transform him or her for from an ordinary individual to the successful individual first is dream i guess you are more dreamy than that of your ward and i believe most of the time we as a parent fail to realize that there there should be a gap between we would like to encourage our ward to actualize our dream in a state of his, his or her dream so their dream needs to be their own don't force them to make certain dreams certainly you as a child also you need to develop or urge yourself that what you are looking for dream it like anything second important thing which one need to follow that is work out on fitness fitness whether it is a mental fitness or physical fitness is very important for a human body whether i'm talking about a boy or a girl it is very important for all of us as a human being a healthy man or a healthy woman healthy boy or a healthy girl is always be able to work out the entire sphere of the life very successfully therefore it is a time for the parents to nurture the habits of having a good workout habits in their child and for particular reasons i i am not uh, talking about anything specifically what workout or fitness in modern days especially in this competitive world as the game changer therefore each one of us need to think about a lot on our fitness levels right from our childhood especially at the age group of 6 onwards the third and most important thing once you would like to transform yourself from your different phases of your life i would recommend for the parents as well as the students as to read whenever you are developing a habit of read as much as possible here i would like to segment one thing reading does not mean for whatever you are reading is a subject or discipline matter as an individual or as a personality whatever is the reflection of hours in entire life is a sum total of reflection of 22 early years and especially 10 years of your childhood so you need to devote yourself uh, for the reading of different contents especially the uh, epics ramayan mahabharat so many uh, a uh, literature is available you can uh, develop certain skills for the knowledge segments which is there in science in social science in the chemical sciences or in the current affairs issues so to nurture your child you need to decide your goal and this particular goal segmentation is the you turn in the life of the child once you are deciding your goal and i thought in this parents needs to make him isolate let him or her develop his goal in his mindset once he or she is been prepared in his or her own way for choosing their goals in their life they are 
almost done the half trick for the success of entire life and once they decide the goal they need to they meant for both parents and the kids they need to devote themselves for achieving those goals it may be unrealistic sometime but there is nothing as impossible or asambhav kuch bhi nahi hai chahat hame uchit prayas ki hai then we can dedicate ourselves for the goal achievement we need not to have fear and for getting rid out of the fear kya hoga kya nahi hoga be like arjun nadanyam na palayanar and we very specific get rid out of your comfort until unless you are there in your comfort zones kids you may not be able to deliver and once you are not able to deliver well there will be certain problems for the stigma of your life choices are always there options are always there but a dedicated person never fears uh, also a dedicated person never hesitate to get it out of the comfort even the comfort zones in our life sometime may be the obstacle to achieving those goals the next step in the life for because life is a some sort of, of great span great amount of time you need to motivate yourself so that there are many speakers many people many mentors many kind of guidance are is to be required in the entire life process therefore make them available parents it's your duty a uh, sound teacher a trainer or a mentor is required especially in this depression arena and therefore to have a competition you need to have a spirit but lo- losing and winning is the merit of the situation so motivation is not only for maintaining the success but respecting or receiving the success in the way that needs to be so motivation is in a very important aspect and therefore people like us can also be uh, very crucial while uh, providing you the motivation sessions i will submit one of the important criteria that is called adopt good habits good habits are like the backbone of your life whenever you are crossing your different phases of your life the good habits will help you enhancing automatically there is no hard and fire rule that you will need to develop such habit and uh, such habit not but certainly good habits is the very fair bank account in your own account which will definitely be debited once it is required and that meant for time only will te- teach you how you need to maintain yourself uh, motivated person for adoption of the good habits you need to follow certain guidelines in your lives set some principle basic ideas of saying good habits that meant for a habit which must not deteriorate your mental and physical health as well as the distraction in your mind any attraction of different reputation may also be called as bad habit so therefore be careful because you are there in the all glitter sort of world and there is there is very important role of the parents where they can help you so be there with your parents while adopting good habits because parents are the benchmarking they can advise you better about the good habits or bad habits in this particular competitive era i would submit for all the parents as well as the students or the kids multiply your skills it is not the era where you can only cope up with the skill or skill sets therefore it is a time you need to multiply your skills you need to be master of the different skills nowadays this is a competitive world you need to take time for your own self you need to have a time for your business you need to time for your expectation personal and public life as well so be a person of a uh, better managerial skills for that there are many mentors many people those are the ideals of your life follow them restrict yourself in a very disciplined self and this disciplined self will guide you to have multiple skills which may help you like anything in your life last but not la- the least be ready for updation anything or everything in the, in this world will 
make you succeed forever that is your ambition once you're thinking that i have done with my abilities you have come to an end for this particular life and once you are thinking maine to sab kuch kar liya wahi se aapka ant shuru hota hai to aapka ant sukhad hona chahiye whenever you are going to conclude that needs to be there on the happy note so these are the 10 points from my my side which may definitely help you out in developing yourself so what you are waiting for try hard and dedicate yourself with these points wish you good luck i will be able to come up with uh, this type of motivated motivational videos for your parents as well as the watch for development of their own life till then watch gyan dhara knowledge for all stay blessed keep updating yourself thank you good night